नमस्कार फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू एक्सपोर्ट इंपोर्ट सप्लाई चेन एंड कस्टम एंड इन दिस मॉड्यूल वी आर कंप्लीटिंग द सेकंड सेशन व्हिच इज रिलेटेड टू द परचेज सोर्सिंग एंड मर्चेंटाइज एग्जीक्यूटिव सो विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द मेकिंग परचेज ऑर्डर ओके सो प्रिपेयर द परचेज ऑर्डर इज ए एक्टिविटी व्हिच इज totally depend on the requirement of the supplier okay so just like once you receive the purchase order on the basis of that purchase order you can prepare perform on the basis of the perform invoice you can prepare the purchase order okay so per perform my invoice is given by the uh, supplier okay here the supplier is the exporter and we are importer so we are as a purchaser we can say importer need to prepare the purchase order purchase order is the written document in which the detail mention regarding the order what kind of goods you require value of the goods term and conditions payment terms and quotation regarding like that okay so another activity which is a taking quotations okay taking quotation is a we can see the rfq request for the quotations you can ask to supplier to ask uh, quotations which is better need to be better and uh, the best quotation need to be implemented and take the approval from this management so this is also the part of this job profile supplier evaluations and making files supplier approve vendor list supplier evaluations in the this uh, activity you have to keep some uh, basic requirements of the supplier just like a the checklist point which is indent of the uh, process okay so as per indent you have to prepare the supplier evaluation checklist in that you have to mention the something like which is related to the process like a timely order received okay and uh, uh, payment related issues okay so, uh, mainly thing is payments okay so timely payments you can mention the details okay and materials are uh, de delivering time check out the material receiving good or not just like a, uh, how is the packing and the time of delivery goods are fit for utilize or not in, in such cases whatever the uh, whatever the service given by the supplier we can use this method supplier evaluation when that we try to inform to our supplier to give best and best service services okay best and best product and then finally finally make the file of this supplier as a vendor list and approve vendor list means that the the best service provider or best supplier will be uh, approved by the management now traveling and collection for order through vendor so in this such cases uh you have to tra uh, traveling for collection of order through vendor as per vendor through vendor you can travel and collect the order from market now research potentially vendor okay uh, now this uh, for this thing here you have to research the potential vendor which is uh, uh, ready for buying your product now compare and evaluate the offer from supplier so whatever offer you receiving from supplier you have to compare and evaluate means check out that which is the best for company or in favor of the company now negotiation contract terms of agreement for achieving best possible price this is also important thing negotiation negotiate the contract terms contract terms means like a payment terms and delivery terms agreement okay for achieving the best possible price 
so you try to giving the best service to the uh, best supplier to the company so in that you have to negotiate all the thing compare and evaluate the things and try to give the best prices so that the cost will be cut down okay now take order and ensure timely delivery of the material so you have to track the orders just like a whatever do uh, whatever orders are in pipeline need to be tracked the what is actually status and wait when will the product received or deliver so timely tracking is a very important for this process reviewing quality of the pro purchased product okay so uh, in the start we have understand the evolution and making the file of supplier so supplier evolution process this also pro, uh, need to be keep the point that quality of purchase uh, quality review the quality of the purchase product now enter order details okay quantity price into the internal database so whatever software you are using like a sap or other erp whatever so in that you have to enter the vendor vendor details quantities prices and all the thing now maintain update record of the pur purchase product this also need to be uh, prepare and update the record of the purchase product delivery information and invoice okay how many product you have purchased then delivery information regarding the and what time and date product is delivered to the customer and record of the invoice these things need to be updated so there is no nothing you have to and try to change yourself sell the new process but yeah, the as per sop you have to work you have to start then once you start this understanding the process we will do accordingly now prepare report of the report on purchase including cost analysis so here you have to prepare the purchase report in which you can update the details regarding the purchase orders okay uh, how many order we received date wise month wise and okay so the report need to be prepared and uh, also need to analysis the cost okay the cost which uh, incur in that particular report purchasing okay purchase purchasing product attend the trade show and exhibitions okay to stay up to date with the industry trends so you know that uh, the exhibition and uh, trade shows are the very important for the marketing for that if you go to the trade fairs and uh, exhibitions you will try to understand the advancement of the competitor product and the, the you can gather the information regarding that and try to update and modify the product which is in trends okay so guys if you have tried to understand working profile of the purchase sourcing and merchandise executives so guys thank you for watching the session have a nice day